Okay. Let's see what else we've got. I tell you what, we've not been off site for a while. I haven't found a branding concept like that I like yet, but I'm running out of storage space. At this rate, I'll need at least four terabytes to keep going. Maybe you can freshen up my desktop wallpaper as well. A painting, maybe? Something abstract? I've never felt this creative in my life. Get me more disk space and I'll meet you at the top. I like it. Okay, what does he need? Upgrade to four terabytes of storage. And install a wallpaper theme. Right, what have you got? He's got a 500 gig Barracuda. That's it. And he wants four terabytes. Hmm. Actually, what have we got? No, we don't have any, any chunky drives lying around. Um, size. There's literally one drive we can put in there. That's a four terabyte. Well, we're just getting one of them. That'll sort him out. How much is he paying for this job, by the way? Doesn't really say. Okay, what was this? Can you find out what's wrong, what's wrong with my computer? It's quieter than normal, making a weird toasty smell. That's probably bad. Also, keep it on the lockdown low, but maybe you can install Heart of Stone for me. I'll play it during runs breaks, I swear. Okay. Place the air cooler. We can add more drives, which is exactly what we're going to do, but I don't have four terabytes worth of space in drives, do I? Hence why I'm buying a four terabyte drive to add to it. So this has got a, a cooler problem. The Arctic Freezer 34. Does it want an identical one putting them back? Yeah, broken. Arctic Freezer 34, broken. Okay. Hang on. Freezer. That's one of those. Okay, we can do that. Uh, does it not say 350 on that job on the blue separator line? Okay, the, what, this one? Which one are you on about? You mean this one or this one? This says pays three hundred fifty dollars, upgrades to four terabytes. This one pays one sixty dollars, and we have to replace the air cooler. Is that what you mean? I don't know. Let's put that down there for now. seven o'clock it's time for the pumpkin round we'll do that in a sec let me set up our new poll final bake off round round three which I believe is the pumpkin round Filling in the poll. <laughs> I just sim one. <coughs> I'll just sim one of them. Hang on a sec. Um, 
I need upgraded power supply for my next project. Was told you can help. I found EVGA parts to be reliable in the past. Um, install the PSU with a wattage of 450, but it has to be EVGA. We may already have an EVGA 450, actually. I think we might be able to do this because we've got some stock. Power supply, EVJ 450, look, what a genius. Look at that. That's because we kept some stock. Missing cables. What are we missing cable-wise? Cheeky. Look at that. Keep some keep some spare power supplies to crack an idea. Turned around instantly. Doesn't get any better than that. I think we're ready for the bake off. Sure. Power supplies. EVGA. Get some more of them. Because they're good. Okay, I think that's the order. For the day. Could possibly have a look at what this one needs. See what this one's about. There's not a lot going on in this thing. Is that an expedition? There's a big operation going on right now. <laughs> was that a 750 no it wasn't no it said replace it with an almost with an evj almost 450 i think it said that's got a 750 in yeah that's bonkers for what this has there's no cpu in it that's a really small motherboard as well like really small look at all the base that's nuts I can't I can't really turn the lights off. If I turn the lights off it won't I don't think it'll work very well. I don't know. We can try it. Right. Bake off time. Let's see if this works. This is the pumpkin round. This is uh This one's called Batty Bat, okay? We'll get some detail going on here. That's the pumpkin number one is Batty Bat. I don't know what it looked like without lights. One second. Yeah, that's what it looks like without the lights. That's called Batty Bat, that one. Okay. That's uh, pumpkin number one. Number two is uh, Peekaboo. Pumpkin number two is called Peekaboo. That's pumpkin number two, Peekaboo. Okay. Put that to one side a second. Uh, pumpkin number three is Kermit. Pumpkin three is Kermit. Okay. And your fourth entry. Pumpkin number four. Is called... Oh, no. That's pumpkin number four is... 
Oh, no. Okay. Right, let me kick off the poll so you can start your voting. You've seen them all now. Uh, start the poll. Okay, the poll is now running. I'll go through the entries again. So option number one is called Batty Bat. Let me show you Batty Bat again. This is option number one. That's Batty Bat. Option number two is Peekaboo. I know they're all great. You just have to go with your instinct. Option number three is Kermit. And option number four is Oh No. Looks like so much work went into all these. Yep. It pretty much did. So there you go. Four pumpkin entries. Currently in fourth place with 10% of the votes is Kermit. In third place with 15% of the votes is Peekaboo. In second place... With 21% of the votes is Batty Bat. And current first place by a considerable margin with 53% of the votes is Oh No. You've got about 40, 30 seconds left to make your votes. Well, you can make or break people's days with these votes. You really can. They're going to go very happy or they're going to be very sad. <laughs> But yeah, seriously, a lot of work's gone into them all. They're all really good. It's a really, really hard vote. Really difficult vote. All right, I think you've got about 20 seconds left to finish the votes. So you had uh, Bassy Bat in there. You had... Peekaboo in there. Then you had Kermit. And then finally, you had Oh No. And the winner, <laughs> with 54% of the votes, I'll just show the winning entry. The winner by over half of the votes is Oh No. <laughs> GG's to everyone they're fantastic well done can we get some GG's in chat for everybody for all the biscuits and the cakes and the pumpkins because there are uh, a lot of work behind the scenes absolutely cool So, oh no won it again is that the second one you won <laughs> which was what was the other one the spider yeah the spider and the oh no same person, daughter's friend. Hacks. No Mrs. Squirrel entries this year. Huge appreciation for the Bake Off participants. Massive effort and they were all fantastic. Love it. Uh, big lad, thank you. Huge appreciation for all the Bake Off participants. Massive effort and they're all fantastic. Love it. Can you get some help to get these? <coughs> <coughs> Tell everyone well done because they're amazing. There we go. That is the Bake Off, the Halloween Bake Off 2021. 
I mean, they they were really good, weren't they? They were really good. So much work went into that. I mean, the cakes were fantastic. The biscuits were brill. Pumpkins. That's a lot of good carving, though. But very professional pumpkin carving going on. Without a doubt. <laughs> Good Dilem job, everyone. Thank you very much, Dylan. Thank you for the bits. And Big Lad, thank you so much for the bits as well. They, they were cool. They were really good. Yeah. I didn't know if turning the lights off was going to work with the whole pumpkins, like whether they'd show or not. But actually, like you see them when they're lit up and then you see them in the dark and they, they look very different. But yeah, no Mrs. Squirrel entries at all this year. I'll have to see if they want to do a Christmas bake-off now. <laughs> Right, um, what is this motherboard? AS Rock Z390 Phantom Gaming. I don't know why this needs a 750 watt power supply. I really don't think it does. I think we can just nick this. We don't need 750 watts of power in here. No way. Even a 600 is overkill. Might wait till the 450s arrive. An RX 450. I don't know what I want to do with this one. Yeah. Good night, Jones. Will she return for the Christmas one? I, I don't know. I think she's responded to criticism, you know? People are saying, oh, she always cheats. So she's like, well, I'll let everybody else have a go. She's fair enough. It's got enough bays for a mega raid. It's got insane amount of bays. Like, it just doesn't need that many bays. It's ridiculous. You can just get rid of all this. Put some SSDs there. You can put giant radiators here and water cool something. It's bonkers. we'll just leave that for a bit put that over here put that one over there and we'll put our order three for stuff Got some stuff in the cart here scumbag is still out of stock completely we can't put another PSU in there uh, computer in there that's pretty much all we can do we've got deliveries coming tomorrow Okay, let's see what the bargain basement team turned up today. We bought a load of stuff. Graphics cards, an RX 580, working. GTX 1060, working. A GTX 960, working. That's, that's pretty good. Some Titan 4 gig, meh. 4 gig 2400. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at that one. Ooh, that's tasty. A Trident Z, 16 gig, 4 gigahertz RAM chip. That's nice. Asus ROG Maximus X, a Gigabyte Z370 Aura's Ultra Gaming. That's not a bad board. B450, a Ryzen 3 Quad Core. I mean, if anybody wants a cheap machine, we can do that. A Ryzen Thread Ripper 16 Core 1950X. Ooh, hello. An i5-8600, a broken cooler. Some broken and working coolers. Do you know what? I think, I think we've done pretty well. I think that cost... How much did that cost? Like $1,000, if that. We've got a load of cards, a load of motherboards, and a load of RAM. I am not unhappy about that. Let's get our bits. <coughs> yeah, that thread ripper's pretty good. Confession time. 
Right, let's get these fixed up. Uh, what was we doing with this one? What's we doing with this one? Seriously, what was we doing with this machine? I can't remember. It might be from. It might well be the same thread wrapper he had. That's your spare PC. Was oh, we was going to sell this, wasn't we? That's right. It wouldn't let me put it in the sell box. Yeah, it wouldn't let me do that with it. Scumbag game. Right, four terabytes of storage and a wallpaper. <laughs> what a random request. Did you say anything about what kind of theme to abstract painting you want? Abstract painting. It's got to be that one, isn't it? The one that 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 um, that daughter did. Yep, I thought that would do somehow. Herman, right, Herman. Great stuff. Confession time. Sorry for emailing everyone, but I did something and you deserve to know. I killed a man. It's the title of my first murder mystery novel. When a body's discovered chopped up inside a computer, Detective Frank Stubble of the NYPD's CCU, Computer Crimes Unit, is pulled out of retirement to investigate. Well, that's a new story. It took well long, and I had to do a ton of research, but now it's finally done. You can buy it online, or come find me at my desk if you want the proper printed book. I might even sign it for you. Gee, thanks for advertising. <laughs> According to my latest readings, I must have my GPU upgraded also. Make haste, for the time is close upon us. Yes, and as I evoke the Great Warren, so you may evoke the MSI Radeon RX 5600 Evoke GPOC, if you so choose. What on earth is all this? Uh oh, I've lost her email now. It was Ellie, that one. She's completely mad, that woman. So basically, we need to order the RX 5700 Evoke GP. Because she specifically wants that. Add to cart. Okay. Please describe the issue here. Hello, I would like to send an online help request for my computer. I need a word processing application, but do not know how to add it. Is my computer powerful enough? I may also need to make some hard copies, so please ensure the printer is in working order. I think we might get a new keyboard as well, one with a caps lock key on it that she can't ever turn on. Please add any additional information here. What's all this about, typo anyway? I've worked here for 23 years and this is the first I've heard of it. Back in my day, we used to Locust Word Pro and 1, 2, 3 and we liked it. Locust Word Pro, I love it.
Let me just unjam the printer. Next. Right, it's installed typo. What is that background? What is that background? This woman is completely bonkers. <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. Typo is installed and working. Uh, I was about to say, wait for it. Just wait for it. She needs more RAM. Don't laugh at your girlfriend. What well, else I can say about your girlfriend? She looks a little hoarse. PB Smoothie, thank you for seven months. Typo, is it called? There we go. She needs a GTX 750 Ti to do a word processor. What are you talking about? You've got to be kidding. No way. No way. Doesn't make any sense. Needs 2 gig of RAM, 2 gig of VRAM, 2 gig of storage. A cheesy Pentium and then a 750 Ti. Yeah, all right. I wonder if we've got anything. What's a 750 Ti on here? 750 Ti. 50 Ti. It's position 300. Do we have anything higher than a 750 Ti in stock? Why does an RX 580 come on that list, I wonder? Three hundred for that. Two fifteen for that. We could stick that in. I think I might have another antihistamine. <laughs> Stupid cold. Should we stick that in and see if that they'll accept it? How much is that worth? One hundred and thirty dollars. She's only paying 140. What? No, that can't be this one. Ellie Crawl, hang on. What's she paying? 1100? Oh, no, hang on. Got the wrong machine. It's this one. Wait, no, he's paying $140 and we have to upgrade the graphics card. What's going on? $57 for a 960 gaming. Should we try that? Okay, we just about make a profit out of that.
Okay, he runs it now. That'll do. Please enter any feedback here. Thank you. This was the best technical support I ever had for many moons. I didn't even have email access until recently. Can you believe that? $69 profit. Such a great job. So glad we did that one. My advanced marketing AI is still creating power issues. Can you manage a second PSU upgrade? Peak power draw has been inconsistent thus far, but it seems to need at least 650 watts. Why are you sending me a PC, but you're telling me what your peak power draw is? Like, you must know what you're talking about. Just fit a new PSU. I've begun the difficult process of giving life to the new one net I designed but my computer still isn't up to the task. Blast those pencil pushes and accounting. If I can get the algorithm running at a mere 63% of capacity, Irritech could be in a position to dominate the markets on a national scale. Can you imagine? But I mustn't get ahead of myself. It is only an algorithm after all. Paying $200. Install a PSU with a wattage of at least 650. Well, we've already got some. I think we've got the, um, oh, I've got 600s. We have got a second-hand 750, but that's overkill. <laughs> 650 is, is really annoying. $60 is the cheapest one we can get. We have two of these in stock. But they're only 600. The next 650 is that one. I guess we'll just get one of these then. When in doubt, assign it to the night shift. I like it. Put that there. That's waiting for a PSU. That's waiting for a PSU. Wait, we can't see next month very easily. We don't work Saturdays. We don't work Sunday, I don't think. So we're back on Monday. Did I buy parts for that, Baz? I can't remember. I think we did. Chucky, thank you for two years. Happy anniversary. I think we bought cool, but I can't remember what we bought. What was the job again? Replace the air cooler. Uh, she wanted a very specific air cooler. It must have been this one. The AR08 Silverstone. Is it that one? Because that one's broken. We've got one right just next to it. But then we've got a broken one of them as well. Was it the Freezer 34? Let's get rid of that one. It's either this or it's this. Can we tell from the original email? Great. It doesn't it doesn't actually tell you when you've taken it out. That's great. Well done. 
You reckon it's a freezer 34? Hope you're right. See, we should have got an RGB fan on there and coloured it pink. Yeah, Macy. <laughs> Extra thanks for hooking me up with Heart of Stone. I'm totally addicted. Even though she said I'm only going to use it when I'm on my lunch break. Honest. Okay, that's that done for the day. Let's get the orders out. And it's Monday. New plants. Well, that power supply was gold. Blimey. Doesn't really go in a red case, does it? RB score, thank you for 20 months. Truly, you are the path to salvation from expiration. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, power supply with a wattage of 650. Okay, Emily, so sorry, but I lost my beautiful rainbow PC. Wait, was this the woman who we made the, the thing flash so that she knew it was hers? Can you quickly put together a new one that runs Mugshot CC? Oh, that means I lost my entire wallpaper collection too. Can you find me some wallpaper that's arty and like abstract? Yeah, it is. Look, you remember you customized the computer so I wouldn't mix it up with anybody else's. It didn't stop someone else confusing my beautiful rainbow baby with their boring beige box because she went missing yesterday. But see, she's willing to pay a thousand dollars. I don't know if we can put together. Because isn't Mugshot CC? Mugshot CC needs 8 gig of RAM, an i5, and a 1050 Ti. We don't have. We just used a card that did that. Can we not get two monitors? It'd be so useful. You could have one on one screen and the other on the other. Send it to the night shift. Do you know what, Max? It's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. Give it to the night shift. Which is another way of saying, I don't want to do this. 
I'm having problems under high load. I think I might just need a better power supply. There are a few junk files on my desk on my disk right now. Coming to the end of a big project, you know how it is. Maybe you could run clean it for me. Okay. Upgrade the power supply. Run clean it. What have you got in there? You got a 350 in there. How much is the job? $100? Well, there's not much margin in this one. Bravo Whiskey, thank you for 28. Good evening. There is no margin in this whatsoever. I'm sorry, but, you know, we're above jobs like that now. Introducing Project Cash Money. Hi, I'm Connie, Eritex Finance Director. I hear you're someone who gets things done. I've come to a plan to dramatically increase our profits. I'll include all the juicy details in the notes below. All I need is an image editing app, but I want it to run properly. Just make sure I've got whatever hardware they recommend. My schedule's absolutely stacked, so I don't have time to drop my PC off. You'll have to come to my office instead. And while you're there, maybe you can have a look at my printer. I ran into some issues with it last week. I'd wanted to try making our own promotional t-shirts to cut the cost. How was I supposed to know they'd get jammed in the printer? Oh, and could you try changing my desktop wallpaper to something a bit more finance director? Cash, money, banknotes, that sort of thing would be great. So here's the plan. Iritech needs more money, and money is cash, right? Banknotes. And what are banknotes? They're just bits of paper with fancy pictures on. And if there's one thing Iritech has loads of, it's paper. Can you see where I'm going with this? We'll all be billionaires by the end of the week. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure, you know, just printing money. Totally legit. Right, have you tried turning it off and on again? Yeah, see, works every time. Nice, nice walnut desk going on here. Very nice, very nice. Recommended spec for Mugshot CC. I'd love to be able to click that. Doesn't mugshot require a 1080? 1050, sorry. Recommended spec. More RAM? More VRAM? Needs a 1070 Ti. We might be able to give them. We might be able to give them a dodgy second hand one. So a 1070 Ti comes up in position 179. And we have a lot of incompatible cards. Apparently they're incompatible. Is it too long for the case? It might be. Let's have a look at what. So she's got a Silverstone CS381.
Maximum GPU length, 267 mil. So literally the only one that will fit is this one. Because that's, that's literally on the money, 267 mil. Basically, we have to buy that card. No, because it has to be a TI. That's not the TI. This is the TI. There's no other card that we can swap in, though. Okay. So all the job's done. Are there any, any dodgy things we can buy? Come on, what's going on with this? Does this just not refresh or what? I thought it would refresh every week. That's the dinkiest motherboard. Phantom Gaming. Right. We're down to the brass tacks now. First of all, what motherboard do we want to stick in there? Can't stick that one. It's broken. That one's broken as well. Get that one in there. Nice, nice start. Good looking motherboard. The Maximus X. Let's go back here. Motherboards. Maximus X. Was it the formula or the code? Code. Why does it not remember the filter? Right, it's Coffee Lake. Supports Crossfire. LGA1151 with RGB. What have we got? Got an i5, which is unlocked, so we could stick that in there. We can overclock that, see what we can do with it. See if we've got a reasonable cooler. Actually, it's got water cool on this. CPU blocks. Actually, what's this case? The fractal design define R white case. Fractal design R5. Okay. Max radiator fans 3 times 120 in 2140s. So we can do a 360 down one side and a 280 down the other, can't we? I just put paste on, didn't I? A 360 and a 240 is what we can get. Size. We want RGBs, don't we? Obviously. For no reason. Actually, we should try and keep the cost down. It's only an, only an i5. 
How about like one of these alpha cools, but they're not RGB, are they? And that's like 700 and something just on that. Oh yeah, it doesn't have a window. That's a good point. It doesn't have a window. We can ignore the RGB. Okay, let's get a 360 and a 240. Then the reservoir. Let's get one of these. It's only 150 for the reservoir. CPU block, we need, was it Coffee Lake? Was it Coffee Lake, that one? I think it was Coffee Lake. So we want just a reasonably cheap cooler in a whitish color if possible. Silver. They're way too pricey. We either go black or we go white. We could go gray. I was kind of hoping for a white one. That's annoying. I guess silver. Go with that. Pipes, I think we've got flexi pipe already. White rigid pipe. I think we'll get some white flexi pipe. It's going to make it so we lose money, but we'll just get some of that for later. Connectors. We've got black connectors already, I think, or we did. Or we've got blue. Silver. Let's get black connectors to complement the white piping, and then coolant, it really doesn't matter. We've already got clear, that's fine. I think that's what we need, isn't it? Unless we want a water cooling GPU, but I don't think we need to. That's already a chunk of cash right there. You've gone for clear flexi white coolant. We could do. We've got. We don't have white coolant though, but we do have clear flexi. I think. Yeah. Either or. We'll buy that. So that's the cooling side of things, Soid. Uh, I don't know what memory we're going to put in here, actually. I'd say either. Probably put that in. Probably put the Patriot in. 3200 be fine. Uh, Stobart, thank you for almost four years. Thank you. So we stick that in there. Graphics card. Tricky one. It's only got an i5. It doesn't need to be stonking. I just want to, like, overclock it, though. 1060 Extreme might be fun. We need a panel on that thing. Right, we need some kind of drive storage on there. Has this thing got M2? Don't think it does, does it? Oh, drive bay's there. It does have M2 on it. Do we need it though? That's the question. Stick that round the back. 
So now we just need to wait for our water cooling bits. Power supply. Um, not a big demand. I think we can probably get away with one of our EVJ 450s. I reckon that might do it. What do you think? Got a 450 to do it on an i5? <laughs> Lol. <laughs> I reckon the 450 will do it. I think we've had a, an i5 before that ran 450 on a 1060. Tell you what I might do though, I might remove it. Switch to white cables. Funky. Power! <coughs> <coughs> career. Okay, we'll wait for the power stuff to turn up tomorrow now. The water cooling stuff, sorry. Didn't actually check what power supply they had. Upgrade the PSU. It doesn't say upgrade it by how much though, does it? Uh-oh, white cable's going in. Rip. <coughs> okay, that counts as an upgrade. It definitely pays having power supplies in stock. It really does. Was that they wanted? Clean it pro. Uh, Scotty McG, thank you for almost three years. Okay. Incomplete case. Thanks. Going to send that email to Leah quickly before I get on with my work. Don't know why I'm telling you about it. Ha ah, ha ha. But seriously, it's not weird, is it? Yeah, I can believe it. Thoughtful gaming. Okay. Oh, God. There's like a load of jobs just came in. Hey, I found a few more of those unfinished PCs in my storage unit. How did you get on with the others? They might not look like much, but I'm pretty sure you can find a way to make a tidy profit. It runs in the family. Jeez, look at all the emails. What is this? Seriously? Where's all the dodgy things I ordered? Wait, have you got any more dodgy things? Oh, yeah. We've had a refresh. 
There's more dodgy stuff. There's a RAM raffle. $199 RAM raffle. GPU bundle. A storage giga bundle. That sounds fun. We'll have that one. Love that one. Love that one. I think we'll have all the RAM ones as well. Cooler crate. There you go. $3,300 for a whole load of who knows what. I didn't see any PSU stuff. It's weird that, isn't it? Let's grab all the new parts. Let's just hope this all fits. I'm not convinced it's all going to fit, you know. Right. Oh, it wants that coming out. Got rid of, rid of all the bays. Wait, what in it like? Okay. Let's go back to white cables again. Oh, come on, game. Why are you putting a black cable in there? Why has that got red on it? Why has that got red on that? That's slightly concerning. It will not let me put a white cable on there. Okay, we've got that on there. We've got the reservoir on here. Doesn't fit. There is no space for the RGB combo white. Hmm. Can't it just stand up here somewhere? What do you reckon would fit then? Reckon a smaller one like that? Is it too tall, I think? That one doesn't fit, and that's not particularly high. Is it because there's nowhere to mount it, maybe? What if you put back some of the... Some of the drive bays, maybe? I mean, I guess we could just get rid of the front red. You just have the little one on top. Actually, we could just put the big red at the top, maybe. If we pop that... Put the 360 on top and just have that one instead. Do it that way. Doesn't fit. Why doesn't it fit? doesn't like it.
I mean, pretty much everything is out in a way, isn't it? I don't think that's a particularly big thing. I just think it can't... Well, here's another nice mess you've gotten me into. It doesn't know where to mount it. It's not having it. I don't know if there's anything that we can do to make it work, you know? Or if there's just a different thing we can buy. What's this? The Corsa XD3 RGB combo. How is that a reservoir? I don't know where it's not really showing me the size. All, all I've got is the picture. It doesn't give me any information about how tall it is. It does. It looks like a CPU block, but it's not. It's under reservoir. The XD5 doesn't fit. The XT3 looks a lot smaller. I could try ordering one of them. Order one of them. I'm going to order one of them as well. I'm just going to assume they've got different kind of mounting points on them. Paid a hundred dollars for same day delivery. <laughs> Custom water cooling. Aha, these fit. That one does and that one does. But they don't. That one can go here. And that one can go there as well. So there you go. That works. Which means is it possible that that rad would have gone back there now? The answer is no. Not so much a res compatibility thing for the water cooling. I can't see it, something. Okay, can we not spin this radiator around the other way? Is it is it possible? Because I really don't want, I want those things over here, really. Does it give you an option to rotate? I don't see a rotate option. Why? It's an obvious thing to want, isn't it? Why would you ever want the connectors down here when you know your pump is going to be at the front of the case? That's a little bit annoying. Woo! Yeah, that looks great. Well done, game. Loving it. Loving that. Oh, because I can't rotate the radiator. <laughs> Black clear coolant. How does that work? I think that's filling up. There you go. You can kind of see it coming down there a little bit. You could use hard tubings and change the positions of the pipes. 
don't think. Yeah, I haven't got any hard tubing ordered. In stock, I should say. Oh, I didn't put my nice black connectors on, did I? Scumbag. How do we empty the coolant out of this thing? There you go. Right, black connectors. Ah, oh, excuse me. Coughing fit. <coughs> God. We need to put the cable back. <coughs> Scumbag cold indeed. We need the dust filter there. There was two little panels at the top, wasn't there? Was it a beauty panel? Right, we've got CPU power, memory. I think we can boot this. Let's see. We need that. What's the point in having full lighting when the case is not transparent, though? That's the only problem.
Right, it's running stably, 56, 55. That's fine. Let's see if we can overclock it a little bit. Thirty two hundred, lovely. Let's see what it thinks about that. Ooh, seventy one, seventy two, look at this. Capped out at 72 Celsius. Nice cheeky overclock. <laughs> I reckon we might be able to squeeze a little bit more out of that. Hey, Miko. You're not going to ask, what did you miss? Halloween Bake Offs. It might undervolt, possibly. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Huh? Not yet. I'm so sorry. Yeah. What? Let's see what this goes to today. Whoa, 77. Woohoo! That'll do. We don't want to be going over 80s, really. It's enough. Let's try the GPU now. We've got an extra 10% performance out of that i5, though. That's not bad. Sixty five Celsius. I think that, that I'm happy with that. I think we squeezed it nicely. Incomplete case. What's it missing, do you think? Front panel? Okay. There you go. Nice little cheeky water cool rig. Okay. Somebody just decided to pull out the cable instead of the panel, but hey-ho. <laughs> I reckon we'll get at least two grand for that. Probably more. That overclock will give it a reasonable benchmark. It's not bad for an i5.
I can't believe how many jobs have been given. I've also been given a whole bunch of, um, oh, look at that. A fractal design R5 titanium with an X399 motherboard. That's it. Like nothing else. Just that. That one is a Coling Big Chungus, which sounds like a very big case. What? That is wicked. Oh, my God. They can have a lot of fun with that one. Oh, boy. That's going to have to be RGB, that is. <laughs> I like that. That one's the white 500D. Just, we can do a, a reasonable rig with that. We could possibly do a tidy water cool with it. 57. Right. Make some money off that one. Why can't we use this storage bay? Wow. Most boring case ever. Yeah, that's... It's called the Colink Big Chungus. <laughs> mm, that's not an amazing score, is it? But... The GPU's kind of learn it down a little bit. But still, for what it is, it's not a bad mint gamer. I'd say. It's worth selling. We could we could improve it with a better GPU, but whatever. Cool. There's loads of jobs left, but we're out of time. So we're gonna have to stop there. Guys, I hope you enjoyed um, today's stream. I do apologize That's about... That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. Thank you, Captain Flink. I do, I do apologize about my cold. Um, obviously, I, it's unavoidable, but it still annoys me that you guys have to listen to that. Um, but it was either that or don't stream, and frankly, I'd just be sat around bored, so I stream anyway. Um, hope you enjoyed the Bake Off. Thank you so much for voting. I thought it was a lot of fun. Um... Next weekend, <clears throat> next weekend, we are planning to enter the 10-hour Suzuka race on Saturday. So I've got practice to do this week. Not sure which car we're going to drive in, but we're planning to do the 10-hour Suzuka race, and, and that starts at midday, I think. Midday UK time, that is. So Saturday will certainly be um, racing. <laughs> Other than that, I don't know what else to tell you yet. I'll have to see what my schedule looks like. Well, yes, it will be a GT3, but I don't know which car. We'll have to test them out and see which ones we like. It's been a while since I've been a GT3. But yeah, um, I hope you all have a lovely week. Thank you for your support, as ever. YouTube video is up today with lots of errors in it because I had a cold when I recorded it so uh, the comments are apparently quite amusing you shouldn't have done that you cock this up you idiot squirrel anyway I'm going to head out now and try and get rid of this cold <laughs> have a cracking week guys yeah I'll do some more transport fever videos this week obviously the landlord super stuff is more or less ended until the update comes out and my summer car, etc. I'm still waiting for them to finish the end game. So we shall see. Um, the the rig tour video that I told you about, you know, the rig that I've got here, that was all filmed on Thursday. That's currently being edited. That's there's a lot of editing on that, but it is quite an in-depth look at my rig, which I know is the video that's been requested quite a bit. Uh, there's also a video on my table coming out as well maybe tomorrow i think looking at the actual table that i use and then the rig video to follow sometime i will do bigfoot thank you mate uh simulators thank you for 70 months well yeah have a great rest of your weekend have a good week and i'll see you all in a few days time thank you to the team as ever for the support over the weekend please give them some gg and some love and i shall see you all very soon take it easy guys love you all good night